It is Funky Function Friday here in the PDX. We're going to bring you some funk. And don't tell your mama. She's going to ask you where you got that funk from, and she's going to want to get in on it too. We're going to talk about the anti-join in Excel's Getting Transformed. And the anti-join, why is it called that? Think about it. Anti. I ain't. I ain't joining if it ain't funkin'. So here we have, here we have two lists of songs and artists. The original list is from an old device and it had all of the music in it that I had. The new device doesn't have all of the music and we can scroll down and look. Oh, all right. 115 songs on this list and this one oh it only goes down to 68 so we got to get this together because something's missing now how are we gonna do that now here's the problem you've got songs that have the same title but not the same artist they might be cover songs like white lines where you have barefoot Duran Duran and the original Grandmaster Flash and Millie Mel doing white lines. I want to have all three on my on my next list. You've got I Miss You by Climax and Incubus, Groove Me, King Floyd and Guy, and Crazy by Seal, Gnarls Barkley, Aerosmith, and you got Creep by Radiohead and TLC. So you got to have all of this, baby, all of it. So now how am I going to recognize what's what? What's missing? We're going to do the anti-join. Here, let's pop this over into tables. Home. Format as table. What flavor you want? Oh, okay. You want to go this way. You want to go to the black and white. All right. Table does have headers. Okay. Yeah. All right. Good choice. Let's get rid of these grid lines. I hate these damn things. Uh, grid lines, boom, go away. And put this into a table. No matter the table. Oh, 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 you won't go with this one. All right, here we go. Just for you. All right. Um, now, we have to make queries. Let's go to data from table. Here's one query. Let's call this original right and I'm gonna close and load this to a connection only ah yeah and we had to do the same thing over on this side from table and let's call this one new Close and load and only create that connection. Right, now we do our merge. We're gonna do that anti-join. And let's think about this now. With an anti-join, you want to find out what is on one list that's not on the other one. So we want to go from the original and look on the new. And if there's a match, we don't want it. We already got that funk. We funkin' over there. We ain't funkin' somewhere else. All right. Now, new query. Merge. We are going to merge the original, leave that one up top, and the new, and we have to tell Excel what's being matched. We'll match song and music, but we have to match both columns, artist and band slash singer. So one, two, one, two, boom. Ah, we wanna do the left anti. Okay. 
can see we have all of these nulls. That means best of my love by the emotions was not found on the other list. Jump by the Pointer Sisters is not on the other list. Let's close and load this. But we're gonna load it to the workbook now so that we can go and get ourselves together. All right. Got it all. These are the 47 songs that we need to go get to make our funk complete. You get familiar with this anti-join and keep spreading that funk. 